By its most basic definition, outsourcing is rather straightforward. It's a contractual agreement between an employer and an external third-party provider, whereby the employer transfers the management of and responsibility for certain functions to the external provider. Now, the need for specialized expertise and timely delivery is one of the driving forces behind outsourcing. A second driving force is the need for cost management. Overall, the fundamental thinking behind outsourcing is the need to let those who can do this better, faster, and cheaper than you do it. Going by this explanation, since outsourcing is simply the contracted use and leverage of third-party resources, assets, and skills, why does it so often go wrong? Since the success of an outsourcing engagement depends largely on the players involved, how can HR and business leaders exploit this tool to their fullest advantage? The answer lies in three parts. First, by understanding what outsourcing is and the processes involved in its execution. Secondly, by knowing how to manage the outsourcing relationship in a way that safeguards the business's own interest, while at the same time getting the best from your outsourcing partner in terms of expertise. And thirdly, perhaps the most crucial of them, by understanding the limits of what outsourcing can truly achieve. Now, in my next video, I will be sharing with you the seven stages of the outsourcing process.